This story is about a man with a vision to reinvent the world's financial system by creating a truly decentralized currency for the masses. That currency was Terra, and his name was Do Kwan. So I said to his face, your size is not size. Right. I'm um, sorry, the question was state your name and your date of birth, but uh, moving on. So sorry to interrupt, but Francis Coppola said our self-correction mechanisms won't work when people start panicking. Dude, I don't have time to talk to the poor, okay? Especially not on Twitter. So tell her, I ain't got no time to debate her, and I ain't got no change on me to give her. <laughs> I, I actually don't tweet that, that's kind of mean. So in the past month, I've been covering stablecoins a lot. And my question is, what makes UST different from other stablecoins? UST is not just a stablecoin. It was. Sure, it's pegged at a dollar. Not for but long. That in itself isn't what makes stablecoins so vital to an ecosystem. Here we go again. A decentralized currency is the key to building financial infrastructure that is beyond the reach of regulations and borders. And to achieve this, we need mass adoption. And to get mass adoption, we need scalability. UST is the only stablecoin that is yield-bearing, interchain, and most importantly, scalable. Unlike another stablecoin that I won't name. It, it, it's DAI, you know, DAI for MakerDAO. Yeah, <laughs> it's the most unscalable piece of shit I've ever seen. But what if UST were to break the peg? Then it would depend on Luna to save UST. But the fact that it's deep pegged, investors will pull out of Luna and tank the price. So it's literally a death spiral. <laughs> investors pulling out. Luna is trading at $80 right now. UST's market cap is at 30 billion, making us the third biggest stable coin. Does that look like pulling out to you? Cause I know what pulling out looks like, right? Yeah. And that's definitely not it. So if you're trying to spread FUD with a little article, then you're gonna have to try a little harder than that. I'm just trying to get my question. Oh really? Are you really? Or are you actually from MakerDAO trying to write a hit piece on Terra? Well, here's something you can write about. Ticker, where are we at? Luna is at $83, up 4%. UST is exactly at a dollar, sir. Beautiful. G Min, how much Bitcoin do we have in reserve? Uh, we bought 1.5 billion worth so far. Make it 10 billion. We're going to be the largest holder of Bitcoin in the world. John Cook, update. <clears throat> Four pools been deployed. All the CVX emissions will go to it. You hear that? We're going to starve three pool to death. It's over for die. You're crazy. Why don't you report back to your little guys at MakerDAO that I'm here to stay? And not only that, but I'm here to destroy every other stable coin in my way. And by my hand, die. We'll die! Woo! Let's go! This is not sustainable and you know it. The economics of it makes no sense. You see my team? This is my head of research. Look at him! He has a crypto punk as his profile, so don't talk to me about economics. Anyone here dissatisfied with how much they've made of Terra? <laughs> Anyone here want to work on another blockchain? Fuck no. Fuck no. Fuck no. Looks pretty sustainable to me. All you detractors, don't you see what you're missing out on? So either you shut the fuck up and buy some Luna, or keep tweeting and stay fucking poor! USD! 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 We're trading a bit below a dollar. We're at 0.998 now. Thanks, Sticker. Well, some people are worried about it getting depegged again. Tweet this for me. Anon, you can listen to CT influencers about USD depegging for the 69th time, or 
Go for uh, a run instead. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, we're depegged at 0.98 now. It's, it's all good. Yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good, right? Finance is calling. Do you want to pick up? Dell? All right, let's sell some fucking Bitcoins to pair market makers. Sir, with that size, it might tank the whole crypto market. I don't care if it tanks the whole market. Defend the pet for fuck's sake. Sending out a 700 million Bitcoin loan to our market makers? If USD goes down, I'm bringing the whole fucking market with me. Dell? What is it? It's trading below 90 cents now. Dope. Dope? It's at 87 cents now. Are you there? And just like that, when Terra needed him the most, he vanished. This video is only made possible for its sponsor, One Inch. One Inch is the biggest DEX aggregator, so it scans all decentralized exchanges to find the best cryptocurrency prices. I use it all the time to swap my tokens because sometimes it's complicated and requires multiple DEXs. And One Inch will find the most optimal path for you so you won't pay too much in fees. If you trade a lot, this will help you improve your ROI. Also, since it's decentralized, you won't face any risk of losing your funds through a centralized entity. By the way, not only are they the biggest DEX aggregator, but they have recently surpassed major DEX Uniswap in direct DAP swaps. And they also have a mobile app available on iOS and Android. So if I hear an important news that can have an impact on trading and I'm not at home, I can now use the one inch wallet to make that trade. Thank God. Check them out, use my link here and try their mobile app. All right, now back to the video. I just... I, I, I just, I, I can't, I just don't know what to do anymore. You know what to do. Like everything in life, you need to make a sacrifice. No, 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 I, okay, I, I need my UST. I need my stable coin. Why do you think you're so attached to your stable coin? Well, I, I mean, isn't that the whole point? When you were a child, did you have a good relationship with your parents? Oh, for fuck's sake, not everything is about childhood traumas, okay? Stability, Doyoung, we need stability. You need to get a stable job. Do you think you can get that with the B plus? Huh? How do you expect to get into Stanford if you're playing StarCraft all day? Go study for SATs. You'll thank me once you get a stable job. Daylock, these stables look amazing. Go on, embrace them. Terra is more than UST. We are strong, not because of how stable UST was, not because of how high the price of Luna rose. We're strong because of our people, because we're lunatics. They can attack UST, they can break our peg, but they cannot kill our passion. We are a team. We've always been, and we will always be. Nothing's changed. Terra is still the most robust blockchain with the best talent pool right now. This ecosystem will not fail. As long as together, we fight for it. So I've decided to proceed and save this ecosystem. No, to save our ecosystem, our invention, our baby. We will fork the current chain and start anew. Reborn into Luna 2.0.
our community is my family. I will always be here, no matter how hard it gets. Let's build it back up again, together. But this time there will be no stable coin, right? But this time there will be no stable coin, right?